So I'm Tasha Danvers, two-time Olympian and Olympic bronze medalist in the 400 metre hurdles. I actually competed in two Olympics, 2000 Sydney, Australia, where I was a finalist. And in 2008, I skipped 2004 because I had a son. And in 2008, I got a bronze medal, like I said, in the women's 400 metre hurdles. So that was awesome. One of the things that I am big on is mindset specifically growth mindset, because there's all kinds of mindsets out there, but growth mindset is what I focus on. And it's important to me because life is about getting better and better. So even when you're young, you know, you want to be the best football player or you, you get a C on your test, you want to get an A next time. So it's all about growth, but how do you grow? How do you get better? And I remember talking to an Olympic champion in my event, and she said to me, that 80% of it was mental and 20 was physical. And I'm like, wow, this sport that's so physical and she's still saying 80% of it is mental. So that made me realize that mindset was a big thing. And so I remember once as a young teenager competing against senior athletes and I was so nervous, like I was, <laughs> I mean, I was so nervous when I was in my blocks, I was shaking. I couldn't keep myself still. I was like going crazy. And the gun went off and because I was so nervous, everyone left and I got left behind and I did not place well. But the key thing from that experience that I learned was when I went to look at the results, I realized that if I had not been nervous and I had just run a regular race, I would have been in the top three if not the top two. So I missed out on an opportunity because I'd allowed my mindset to control what was going on. So from that point onwards, I decided I'm going to change the way I think about being in a race with senior athletes. And so I told myself, don't worry about it. It's just another race. It's the same number of hurdles. It's the same distance. Why are you freaking out? Just because some other great person is in the race. And I took that to the 2000 Olympics. And because of that, in my team, I was the only uh, female, there was three of us, I was the only female 400 meter hurdler to make it to the final. And it was because of that mindset that I had taught myself many years before. So growth mindset is, people think that when they see a champion, they're just like that, they're just tough. and but. Anybody can learn to be a champion. Anybody can learn to have a champion mindset. You choose, you decide, and from that point forward, you, you can allow yourself to grow and grow and grow. So let's try adding a growth mindset to the workout we're about to do. What's up, Ready, Set, Go kids? I am Tasha D back again to do this amazing workout with you. I'm so excited. We are gonna get started. So just to let you know, we're gonna start out with a nice warm up. We're gonna do four exercises two times and we're gonna follow that with two circuits. Now remember, it's a growth mindset workout. So when your mind starts telling you you can't do more, you tell it, yes, I can, all right? So let's get going. We're gonna start out with some jumping jacks, nice and easy. It's the warm up, ready and go. Awesome. See, that's not so bad. When was the last time you trained with an Olympian? Probably not too long ago if you're a ready, set, go kid. <laughs> awesome job. Now, after this exercise, we're going into butt kicks. And I'll show you exactly how to do that. Nice big arms. All right, let's go straight into our butt kicks. We're doing 30 seconds of each one, by the way. So you want to make sure that your heels come as high up to your butt as you can, okay? And swing those arms. They're important too, especially if you're a runner. Got to move your arms, move your legs all together. Keep going. We're not there yet. We're getting our body nice and warm. So important. All right, right there, hold it. And let's go into side to side lunge. So lunge out, feet together, and then lunge to the other side. Feet together, lunge to the other side. There you go, you got it. Keep repeating, just like that. It's so important to get a good warm up. Do you know why? Because it helps prevent injuries. No athlete wants to be injured. All right, so right here, we're gonna get into our high knees. 
follow me there you go so you want to make sure swing those arms nice and big get those knees up and toes too keep your toes up nice and easy one two one two I might run right out the stadium if I'm not careful <laughs> awesome that's round one so we're right back to the beginning with jumping jacks here we go pace yourselves there you go try and touch your hands together at the top you got it can you remember what the next exercise is butt kicks good job I'm running I'm running get those heels up to that butt good job keep swinging those arms you guys are doing great I can see you <laughs> all right now we're into our side to side lunge remember feet together stretch your inner thigh there you go be gentle as you come down don't force it remember we're still in the warm-up good job nice deep breathing good job what's our next exercise can you remember tie knees good job toes up swing those arms nice and high there we go get those knees up we're almost finished don't stop now keep going three two and one you finish your warm-up and it's time for our first circuit all right we're gonna have a little bit of rest before we get into circuit number one so this is a good time to control your breathing see if you can breathe in through your nose out through your mouth and again in through your nose out through your mouth good. there and if you need water this is a good time if you have some nearby don't go running off to the store trying to get out of the workout <laughs> if you need a little water right now and you have some close by go ahead and take a sip all right so are you ready to get started with the juicy bit the actual workout because we are ready to rock and roll we're going to start with what's called a reverse lunge so a regular lunge you probably know this goes like this but a reverse lunge we're going to be stepping back in reverse all right so we're going to do 45 seconds of each exercise one round then we're going to do 30 seconds and then 15 seconds so we'll start with our reverse lunge we'll get into our push-up exercise and then we're going to move to our side to side rainbow so let's get started three two one and let's hit back there you go now remember opposite arm opposite leg so you see if my left leg's in front my right arm's up keep going good job by the way don't forget to smile when you're working out because it's so much fun <laughs> all right there we go oh got the bubbles there you want to try and stay as steady as you can there you go perfect now push up through this heel you come up and squeeze your butt there you go step back squeeze your butt push up through the heel perfect and again each side squeeze up nice job now we're going to get down into our push-up so this one's a little bit different from a regular push-up you're going to go down touch the floor hands up back up touch your shoulders now if you're not good with a regular push-up you're not that strong yet that's okay i can't do it all the time either you get onto your knees do the same thing all right so here we go three two one and down hands up up tap tap down hands up up tap tap down hands up up tap tap good job and again tap tap down hands up up tap tap down hands up up tap tap come on you got it 
remember growth mindset here if we're not gonna quit we're gonna keep going until all 45 seconds are complete in three two one excellent now we've got our side to side rainbow if you don't know what that is we're gonna go from side to side so here jump from one side to the other ready in three two one let's go and down there we go come on if you think you got it you can go faster than this old bird <laughs> your youngster should be out hawking me there we go that's it make your rainbow super and up and up good job and again excellent keep going three two one good job now it's time for our 30 second round how are you guys feeling two thumbs up all right so we're back into our reverse lunge nice and easy here we go three two and one squeeze opposite arm opposite leg good excellent let's turn it this way so i can see your pretty faces <laughs> good squeeze that butt as you come up in three two one down on the ground all right remember if you're not so good we're right here 30 seconds let's go hands up good tap tap not not so good but more as in not that strong yet did i miss the lift off the ground here it is <laughs> tap tap try and keep your body nice and straight hands up tap tap down again last one three two one and done not done all the way we're done with that so now we're going side side rainbow three two one 30 seconds let's go there we go how high can you go how high can you go higher than me i hope i left my hops at home i forgot i needed them today <laughs> so hope you brought yours three two and one take a nice deep breath that was 30 seconds guess what the next one's even easier 15 seconds that's it and we're done with this first circuit good job all right so here we go three two one and back try and stay balanced no wobblies there you go remember to push up through the heel squeeze that's it good one more excellent down on the ground three two and one hands up up tap tap down hands up up tap tap down hands up up tap tap and you are done yes that's me swimming out of here but i'm gonna come back because we got another circuit you ready <laughs> Awesome, so remember during this phase where we're resting rather than messing around and playing around it's a good job to get your energy back get your breathing back to normal so breathe in through your nose out through your mouth again, in through your nose and when you breathe in if your tummy pokes out that's actually a good thing because all the air is coming in the chest is expanding and then out through your mouth again perfect, alright now hydrate, hydrate, hydrate I hope you've had a little sip Water. when you're exercising it's always good to have water nearby awesome now I just I just feel it I can just feel your energy that you are so ready for this second circuit and so am I I love working out with you guys so the next circuit is gonna be 
40 seconds on, 20 seconds rest. Okay, so we're gonna work out for 40 seconds, we're gonna rest for 20 seconds. And guess what, we've only got three exercises in this one. We've got the Russian twist, so we're gonna sit on the ground, we're gonna twist from side to side. We've got in and out squats, I'll show you those. And we've got an explosive knee drive. You're gonna love it, okay? So first of all, we need to get down on the ground, and I don't want any hunching. You know, my son loves to hunch, and I always poke him in the back. So just pretend I'm poking you in your back. You're nice and tall. Now, here's the thing. If you think you're a superstar, you can lift your feet off the ground. If you're an old bird like me, you can keep your feet on the floor. That's where I'm gonna keep mine, okay? So toes up, back nice and straight. Are you ready? Three, two, one, let's twist. Side to side. All right, why am I doing this with my hands? Because I'm used to having a ball here. You don't have to pretend you have a ball, but if you're like me and like to use your imagination, you can. Now, make sure your whole shoulders are turning all the way from side to side. Not like this with your hands. That's not really doing anything. You want to go all the way, side to side. Are you strong? Can you lean back a little bit more? There you go. From side to side. And we are into our next exercise. We're going to get back up on our feet. Feet are shoulder width apart. We're going to do bounce, 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 bounce. In for two, out for two. Okay, here we go. Follow the leader. You guys play Simon Says? I haven't played that in a long time. Today it's called Tasha Says. Tasha Says two bounces in the middle, two bounces to the side. Two bounces in the middle, two bounces to the side. I think I did three on one of these. Who's counting, eh? You are. <laughs> okay, again. Keep going. Someone's like, where's the clock? This must have been 40 seconds by now. Three, two, and one. Perfect. Now, explosive knee drive. We are going to get down. Remember, we did that reverse lunge earlier? Well, now we're adding some flair to it, okay? So you're gonna come up. If you are a superstar, and if you're not, it's okay, because I'm not a superstar all the time either. You're gonna come up and just drive. No lift off the ground. But if you want to go for it, you can come up off the ground. Now we are gonna alternate. So you'll come up, switch legs, back, up, switch legs, back. All right, ready? Three, two, one, and let's hit it. Drive and tap. Drive and down. Notice I'm doing opposite arm, opposite leg. It's a funny thing about that. Keep going. That you can't really do stuff well if you do the same arm, same leg. Have you ever seen someone walk? Same arm, same leg. It's really weird. Keep going. Don't copy me. <laughs> Unless I'm doing the exercises. <laughs> Are you driving up? Are you with me? Drive up if you can. There you go. We're almost there. And time. Ooh, resting. That's your first round. We've got two more and then guess what? We are done. You know? All right, so take a deep breath. In through your nose, out through your mouth. One more time. All right, too much rest, let's go. Back down on the ground. You tried to trick me, I see that. Three, two, one, and twist. Remember, shoulders going all the way. What do you guys think of my purple hair? It's very deceiving, you know? From the back, I'm probably purple. But from the front, I just look like I have regular black hair. It's my magic trick. You know what it is, really? I think I'm a unicorn. All right, lean back. If you can, going for that nice strong position. Not if your back's hurting, no, you'll be nice and straight. Three, two, and one. We are done with our second round of Russian twists. It's time for our pulsing squats. Two middle, two sad. Two middle, two sad. Okay, ready? Down and out. Down. And out to the middle one two and the side to the middle one two and the side all right you've got this 
when you're doing exercises, even though it's hard sometimes, you want to make sure that you are paying attention to your breathing. You're like, oh my gosh, I've got to pay attention to my legs and my breathing and my arms, but I promise you it will help you. All right, three, two, and one. What's next? Remember? I knew you would remember. Explosive knee drive. Ready? Reverse lunge into a hop or reverse lunge into the drive. Your choice. All right. Drive up. Switch legs and back. Good. Switch legs. Drive up. Switch legs. Drive up. Switch legs. Drive up. Keep your stomach nice and tight. Squeeze it. No matter what exercising you're doing, I want you to think about pulling your belly button into your spine. That's the perfect position. Three, two, and one. Oh my gosh, time flies when you're having fun. Take a little breath here, in through your nose, out through your mouth. One more time, in through your nose, out through your mouth, let it all out. Awesome. Ready? This is it guys, the grand finale. So I want you to give it all you've got. Let's get down on the ground. Let me get my unicorn out of the way. Remember, nice and straight. Toes up or off if you can. I'm gonna go for it this time, ready? Do it with me, three, two, one. Come on, come on. Remember, not just their hands, that's for the dance show. You wanna do the actual shoulders deep. two in the side ready three two one and bounce bounce ah yeah I could do this all day but I know you'd rather do PlayStation so I won't I'm just gonna stay right here and do it for 40 seconds not all day but I could you know I could do this all day I have muscles like the rock got muscles just like that. What do you mean you can't tell? <laughs> Keep going. Remember last set. Three, two, and one. You are done with that. We have, guess what? One more exercise. You know what that's like? That's like being at the finish line of the Olympic Games, coming down the home straight, and this is it, okay? So we're gonna make sure we do this with everything we got. Last one. Come on. 40 seconds on. Three, two, one reverse lunge, drive up, reverse lunge, switch legs, drive up, switch legs, drive up, switch, drive up, switch, drive up, switch, drive up, switch, drive up, come on. This is it guys, come on, growth mindset, push yourself, what your body says, I can't do anymore. You say, yes, I can. Yes, I can. Who are you, buddy, to tell me I can't do any more? Three, two, and done. Woo! You did it. You rocked it. You smashed it. You guys are awesome. I can't wait to work out with you again. See you soon. Ready, set, go. Okay, after every great warm up and workout, we need a cool down to get our body back to normal, okay? So we are gonna start with, since we used our arms a lot, we're gonna stretch this shoulder area. So I want you to grab your fingers behind your back, lock them in, feet apart and just bend down. You can slightly bend your knees if you want to and see how far you can stretch. Woo! We're gonna do this for about 20 seconds, okay? Keep going, hold it right there. Uh, am I in Australia? I feel like I'm on the other side of the world here. Ah, good stretch. 
and come up slowly good job let's bring the arm across the chest here stretch these shoulders just a little bit more doesn't it feel good just relax are you proud of yourself you got that workout done you're gonna be healthier fitter oh really stretch that press up against the elbow there nice and gently though not too hard perfect now let's switch sides here there you go nice good stretch here this is a good time to practice your deep breathing too in through the nose out through the mouth again in through the nose out through the mouth perfect all right now let's get some leg action going because we use our legs a lot so see if you can get your balance you might need to hold on to something and we're just going to stretch our quadricep muscles that's the muscle right in front here okay so hold this there you go and switch sides you guys are good there you go balance nice and tall stretch that arm all the way up pull your heel to your butt good stretch there good all right just a little bit more here i'm gonna get down on the ground and we're gonna sink our hips to the floor you should feel a stretch right here in your hip flexor muscle all right don't put too much pressure on your knee just see a gentle stretch right in here good job and out we go other side we got one more stretch and we are finito okay stretch that hip flexor out <sighs> nice deep breath and push out good last stretch gonna put our feet together slowly down can you touch your toes I almost can can you touch the ground can you put your hands flat can you I can't see you okay now I can see you there you go <laughs> touch your toes good job stretch 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 and slowly come up okay wasn't that amazing I am so thankful to you guys for doing this with me. It's been an honor. I just want to say a big thank you to the Foundation for Global Sports. And I'll see you kids next time. Ready, Set, Gold 2020 Fall Series is brought to you with support from the Foundation for Global Sports Development and Sidewinder Films.